This is Dr. Tracy K, and I wanted to show you a brief, quick, little couple of minutes on how to do some stretches for right before you do meditation. So, have your Bluetooth headband, and you have your phone or whatever. You get ready, or your med or your Zen chair, or your meditation cushion. Um, or you, if you have one of those sleep phones, or if you have a uh, brainwave tracker, whatever, I highly suggest those as a recommendation. And so you really you kind of want to release a lot of that tension before you meditate. So I'm going to give you some basic stretching exercises, some yoga exercises, and um, say hi to Poker. He's my assistant today. <laughs> and also having... Um, animals so you bring good energy. So what I want you to do is this as your lotus pose. So you're gonna you if you're real flexible, maybe you can sit like this. If you're not so comfortable, you can just sit however it makes you comfortable. This is a good open pose for um, anybody who wants to relax. But the first pose I'm gonna show you is um the cow cat pose. It's gonna open up the spine Okay, because your spine is the rod to your energetic systems. And when you're doing these meditations, um, you'll be getting some frequencies and, you, and it, you're going to be retraining your brain. So you want that spine to be open. So the first pose you can do is the cat cow pose. You're going to come in all fours. Make sure your hands are underneath your shoulders. Right now, it depends on your instructor, but I like to do it this way. You do what you want, you know. So when you're doing the um, the, the cat pose, you're going to be pushing off and turning, curving your body. I like to inhale because one of the breath you're going to learn is you're going to put your chin to your chest. And then I want you to push your head all the way up and I want you to release like a cow. Ooh. So you're going to meow. Ooh. Try that one more time. Meow. Inhale. Hip to the chest. Ooh. And release. Okay? Now. Second pose I want to show you is it's really good for people who are dealing with um, you want to get your stretches of your muscle. So as you're here, um, you can uh, wherever you feel like, you know, put your toes under, and then I want you to push off with your hands. I want you to come all the way up like this. Once you can put your heel on your meditation cushion, or if you're going to do it, you can all the way to the floor. As far as you can put your hands, depending on how flexible you are, okay, you find where you're comfortable in. Ready? Now, as you're in your position, you're going to be stretching it out. I want you to grab a hold of your elbows. I want you to slightly pull down on your elbows and hang your head. And just breathe. Put your head between your arms. You can swing back and forth if you want to. Find your balance. You're off balance a little bit. Flatten your toes more on your yoga mat. And or, and gently bend your knees. Don't knock your knees out, okay? That feels good. All right. Now release your hands. Now what you do is put your hands on your knees. And slowly come up. All the way standing. 
Can do that again. You reach your hands up all the way, fold forward. Bend your knees slightly. Press your teeth in. Grab a hold of your elbows. Pull down slightly. Put your head between your arms. And breathe. Deep breaths. You should really feel that spine stretching. Now, release your hands and bend your knees. Come slightly down. And I want you to put your knees on the outside of your hands, okay? You'll be on your toes. Now, what I want you to do is I want you to go ahead, because we really need to get these hip connectors straightened out. So what I want you to do is I want you to take and be gentle on your knees here, guys, okay? Whoever needs help. Put your elbow right in the sockets of your knees, okay? And then I want you to slowly bring your hands out. Now, if you're real, if you're real good balance and flexing, come up here like this and put your hands in a prayer mode position. And then put your hands also like this. And then if you want to, if you're more, if you want to move in flexing, you can actually take and do all the way out. Seat your teeth, tailbone down, all the way down to the ground. There you go. And push out on your knees. Alrighty. Oh, that's so good, huh? <laughs> ah, this releases a lot of tension. And just move back and forth if you like to. Excellent. Now go ahead and have a seat. Bring your knees in. Stretch them all the way out. Shake them out. Make your seat position. Wiggle your toes. I want you to wiggle your toes and circulate them around. Back and forth. Circle to the left. Circle to the right. There we go. Moving back and forth. Same with your wrist. Ready? Now, two more, two, two more different type of poses to go. So first thing you're going to do is you're going to lift your hands up and fold all the way down and grab those toes in between here. If you want to, if you're not flexible, right here on your shins. If you're real flexible, come all the way down. Fold your hands like this. Reach all the way. You can grab here and down. Excellent. And then we want to do this, kind of want to release the side here. So, put your hands down next to your hips. Lift your right arm up. Slightly bend your left elbow and lean all the way as far as you can. Breathing and stretching. Point your toes. Up. You can go back, look up at your hands, just work with it, how you like. And release. Same way on the other side, your left your right elbow, and bring all the way to the side. And if you want to, you can rest your head here for a deeper stretch on your tent chair. You can also use your pillow to support you on your tailbone or anything like that, okay? Oh, this sounds wonderful, huh, sweetheart? So that's some great pre-stretching yoga or pre-stretching to get you started right before you meditate. And then you want to just go ahead and get your headband, Bluetooth, get your thing, download my program. Up on your Bluetooth. Use your meditation pillow. Or get in your Zen chair. Meditate. No. Or you can do your couch. One or the other. Alright, guys. Enjoy your journey.